Domestic Urban Product Manager for FiberOptic.com. Today we're with Matt Brown from JDSU, and he's going to show us some of the fit kits. Hi, I'm Matt Brown with JDSU. We're manufacturers of test and measurement equipment. I'm a product manager for fiber optic test gear, and today I want to talk to you about our new Essential Fiber Toolkit. This kit contains our HP360 integrated optical power meter and fiber inspection scope. This product has a dedicated fiber inspection scope for the test lead or switch over and use a dedicated optical port inspection probe. The carrier holds uh, has a place for holding spare tips and adapters. If we find contaminated fiber in our network or our infrastructure, we're going to want to clean it. So we've included a fiber optic cleaning tool into the carrier. This tool is suitable for both cleaning patch cords, as so, or if your bulkhead port is dirty, you remove the tool from the carrier, pop off the, uh, the cap, and clean your optical port. If there's a problem on that line and you need to troubleshoot it, we've included a small BFL for tracing uh, faults on your, on your line. We've integrated all these tools into this industry carrier that goes right around the technician's neck. So now I've got all the tools I need to handle, uh, test, or troubleshoot my optical infrastructure in one convenient carrier, which gives me the use of my hands. Now let's look at how this essential fiber cleaning kit works. If a technician is using this kit uh, to go out in the fiber plant and check light levels or loss on an optical channel, the first thing they're going to do is remove the probe microscope, plug it into the optical port, and check to see if that port is clean. Well, this port isn't clean, so the technician is going to want to clean it before he plugs his test temper into it. He pulls out the cleaning tool, removes the cap, and cleans that optical port. Take our probe microscope back out of the carrier, plug it into the port, and check to see if it's clean. And we have effectively cleaned the port. Now that I know the optical port's clean, I'm going to switch over to my patch cord microscope and check my test lead. I can see my test lead is filthy, so I'm going to want to clean that. I pull the test lead out, I put it into the cleaning tool that's held in the carrier, give it a couple cleans, put it back in the patch cord viewer, and now I can see that my test lead is clean. Now I take my test lead, plug it into the port, and I measure light levels on the optical power meter. For example, uh, these light levels were low, or he's troubleshooting a problem on this line and he doesn't have power. He can take uh, the patch cord, the test lead, out of the optical power meter and put it right into the VFL. Turn the VFL now on, and now he's sending visible light um, down the optical fiber so he can trace out a fault. I'm going to show you how this new Essential Fiber Toolkit is going to benefit your organization by changing the way that your technicians work. To do that, Rick, old school, Carmenetti, and I are both going to check light levels or take a test on an optical channel. I'm going to do it with this hands-free essential integrated toolkit, and Rick's going to do it with the old standalone visual inspection tool, standalone optical power meter, a test lead, and some cleaning tools. So first thing is we need to check uh, the end face of the connector behind the bulkhead, right? So we pull out our probes, we come over here and look at the connector. Mine's dirty, I'm going to have to clean it. Mine too, you're too. So we both have to go and, and clean the port before we can plug our patch cord in. So pull out the cleaning tool. Go over the bulkhead, give it a couple of cleans, and check it again. Now the connector behind the bulkhead's clean. How are you doing? Uh, clean. Behind you. <laughs> You're cleaning. Okay. Uh, next, I check the patch cord. I don't want to uh, plug a potentially dirty patch cord into the optical port, and my patch cord is dirty. So I pull the patch cord out of the patch cord inspection scope, put it into the cleaning tool. Give it a couple cleans and put it back into the microscope. Now it's clean. I can take it and plug it into the optical port. Now I'm plugged into my channel. I'm connected to my uh, optical power meter and I'm reading my light level. It's done with that test cycle. And you're just still checking the patch cord. So maybe there is no light level on this. Maybe there's no light present on this channel and he needs to uh, troubleshoot that line. Well, we put a, BF a VFL into the kit. So he just pulls his patch cord out of the power meter puts it into the VFL and plugs his test lead into the optical port. Now I've got a VFL pushing power, pushing visual light 
into the line, this tool set gives me my hands back. So I'm able to open cabinet doors or check through bundles of patch cords or look for the fault on the line. Almost there? Almost. <laughs> Almost there. Reading? Yeah, reading. All right. So he's got his light levels. And he'd either record that uh, value, or if it was dead, you put a VFL into it and trace that out, right? So you want to put your VFL in there and run that test? I would if I didn't forget it in the truck. <laughs> the VFL's in the truck. So in conclusion, when you give the technician uh, the right tools, you impact his behavior. Uh, you're going to get, you're going to benefit uh, from efficiency. Your technician is going to take less time uh, on target with every test cycle. The quality of the technician's work is going to be improved because they're going to be driven towards a process that protects the optical infrastructure, and they're going to have a more repeatable process, right? Because they've got a work, they've got a tool that guides them through a certain a certain workflow, and they're going to repeat that workflow over and over again. So again, I'm Matt Brown, I'm with JDSU. Uh, we've been looking at our new Essential Fiber Toolkit. It's been a real pleasure to be here with FiberOptic.com. Thanks for your time.